So in this video, I'm going to show you how to overlap a div in HTML and CSS. So you see, I have this header here and I have this navigation bar. So let's say that we want to move this navigation bar a little bit up on top of this div. So we want to overlap them. So to do that, it's really easy. All you have to do is you have to select the header. So you see, I have this div. I have given it the class header. Um, and right here, I have this div below it. I have given it the class nav. So I have them selected. So both of them are selected here. So you see on line 12, I have said dot header to select that element using CSS. And we are going to add a property here, which is called Z dash index. So Z dash index, and you add a number here. For example, let's change, uh, let's add this one. Let's make it two. So I have given it number two and right here we can copy that index and we can apply it to the navigation bar. So you see we have that there too, but you see they don't have, uh, I mean the, the, the Z index is equal. So now there it's like we have not given them because they are two. So two and two basically means default. So we are going to give this one more because this one uh, we want the nav to be on top of the header. So to do that, we are going to increase uh, the Z index from the nav. So you see, instead of two, we, are, we can say three. So we ha this one has more power now. So this one is going to be on top of this one. So right here, we are going to basically push this navigation up a little bit. So to do that, we are going to use something called, you can either use position or margin, but I'm going to use margin top. It's really easy to do that. So I'm going to say margin, so margin dash top colon. And right here we can say, uh, we want to move it up. So we are going to say negative 100 pixels. So you see now this one is a little bit up. Now let's view it on a browser. So this is what we have. So you see, this is the header. All right. So this is the header div and this div is on top of it now. So now let's add another div here. So let's see that we have another div. So let me just add another div to the HTML right below the nav. So let's say that we have a div and I'm going to give it a class. I'm going to name it content and I'm going to add a small paragraph here with some text. All right, so I have some paragraph there. All right, so I have that paragraph. So let's select that with CSS. So we are going to say dot content, select that div. Let me change the background color to orange. And uh, let's say that we want to move this one on top of this one. So you see we have, uh, let's view it. So you see we have this div here. So let's say that you want this div to be on top of this nav. So it's really easy because uh, we can use this Z index. So you see now uh, the nav has Z index of three. So absolutely we'll have to add the Z index to the content and but we'll have to give it a bigger number than three. So instead of saying three, I can say four. All right, because this one will be on top of the nav and now let's push it up so margin dash top negative 100 pixels so you see it's way up so let's go negative 20 pixels or 25 pixels okay so now you see this one is on top of this one so if i go to file save and refresh so you see we have moved it up a little bit all right, everyone. So this is basically how you can overlap divs in CSS and HTML. So I hope you liked the video. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments and I'll be happy to help you all.